Hey YouTube, uh, it's day three. I spent pretty much all day Saturday and Sunday uh, piecing this together and trying to recondition the battery bank. Um, right now, the wire's a little bit haphazard and have not been tucked away, but I wanted to check functionality to make sure that everything was working. Um, the far right box that is uh, my negative bus bar as well as my shunt for the uh, battery monitor my positive bus bar this is way cleaner than it used to be um, that uh, main is my battery disconnect um, trimetric battery monitor remember I'm running a 48 volt system now I'll talk about the battery in just a second this switch is um, the solar uh, main solar disconnect which right now it is disconnected and then obviously charge controller um, this is the battery bank. Uh, as you can see, I have eight six volt golf cart batteries. I'm getting a little bit of off gassing that I'm going to have to clean up. Um, these have been sitting for two years. Um, whenever I stored them, they were at full charge. I made sure. Uh, that they were full charge and then uh, we moved and this is where we are now I've charged the first um, which which if I would have thought about this I would have done this in parallel but I char charged the first four um, these first four right here um, for about 17 hours um, and the top four are going to be uh, charged um, equally um, which by my calculations will get to tomorrow morning around six or seven in the morning which I'll pull off the charger and I'll turn on the solar and we'll see what happens um, the reason why I'm doing in sections obviously is because um, my charger here only charges 12 volt or 24 volt. Um, so that's where we're at. They've been bubbling glorious. So if you can see, that's the first uh, 24 volt grouping. Uh, that's been dropping um, throughout the day. Uh, which, you know, there is some battery damage, but I'm hoping to, you know, continue to charge and recondition these as we go. And the overall arrays of 51, if I can use these batteries to limp through um, for a little bit, I will. Um, what I really want to do is test the DC uh, capabilities of this and not do any kind of grid tie. I won't hook in my uh, inverter which is somewhere behind me. Um, the inverter that I had which was a 24 volt inverter so I wouldn't be able to use it anyway. Um, what I did do is I bought this uh, DC step down. As you can see it will take a 45 volt input and output it at 12 volt um, and right now my garage is pretty dark especially at night I mean I'm using this just crazy setup right now so I want to get a, a 12 volt light system um, and some fans running on this nonsense for the summer etc etc before I move on anyway this is already too long um, it's the next phase. I'm pretty excited about this. I also have a um, um, apparently cat using litter box behind me. 
um, as well as a, uh, a pretty sweet charge controller coming my way in the next month. Anyway, thanks for uh, watching. Uh, more updates. We'll see if these batteries will, um, will hold up or if I have to buy new ones. Anyway, thanks for watching.